one click is all it takes to lose everything. We are in a cyber war. You can either be a defendant or you could be a victim. Cyberspace is dangerous. There are a lot of companies and a lot of people that want to hurt you, that want to make money off of you, and want to exploit you. If you have that mentality, you would read more carefully before you click yes, yes, yes. It always amazes me that in the real world, if you're asking somebody to sign a contract, if you're asking somebody to agree to a piece of paper, people usually read it. However, online, people click yes, yes, yes to everything. They do these joke tests. Well, I shouldn't say joke, they're real experiments, but the results are, are laughable in terms of what they come out with. But basically, they go in and they put up these images for people where it basically is a message. Do you want all of your personal information to be compromised and sent to a foreign adversary, yes or no? And it just pops up over the normal working of a user. And nine out of 10 people just click yes, yes, yes. Because they want to work, they want to be productive. We have trained ourselves not to read messages. We have trained ourselves not to look at what we're agreeing to. And I will tell you, that's dangerous. Because if you look at a lot of the laws out there, they say that these social media sites need to ask your permission. So if they're asking your permission and you blindly say yes and you don't know what you're agreeing to, that's problematic. And this was evident with the recent Facebook issue where Facebook, yes, Facebook was sharing your information with third parties. However, they asked you, there was a message that said, do you want to allow third parties to access your information? And you had to explicitly hit yes for that to happen. And people are freaking out. Congress is freaking out and everyone's like, that's unacceptable. And I'm sitting there going, once again, not thrilled with everything that Facebook's doing, but this one, I sort of got a side on the side of Facebook. Oh, wait a second. If they're asking you a question, if they're saying, can we do this? And you're saying yes, why are we then blaming them? We have to pay more attention. We have to be more careful. We have to actually read what we're agreeing to. And if we don't understand it or we don't want our information shared, we need to start saying no a lot more than we say yes. So my two pieces of recommendation to you, before you agree to anything, read it, read it, read it. And if in doubt, no should be your de facto answer, not yes.